Hi, welcome back to NFT Gaming and for today's video, I'm gonna do a video about Pegaxi. So if you guys don't know yet, there will be a breeding event on April 3rd and when this event has started, there will be no cooldown on the breeding at all. So how do I know that the breeding cooldown is zero? Well, you guys just have to listen to this guy. The breeding cooldowns of all breedable Pega will actually be set to zero. Meaning you guys are actually able to breed your Pegas as many times as you want with no cooldowns to get a feel of the breeding mechanics. So if you guys still do not understand what he's trying to say, what he means is that for every breeding that you do to your parent Pega, there won't be any breeding cooldown at all. However, there will be a racing cooldown as per normal which is 96 hours. So let me repeat one more time, there will be no breeding cooldown at all. All, however, there will be a racing cooldown during this breeding event. Now, the question that most of you guys will probably have is what is the reason for the breeding event? So, if you actually watch this guy video again, he will specifically mention that you can actually fuse two horses which have the same rarity in order for it to actually up tier their rarity. So, what I mean is that it can go from pacer to rare, rare to epic, and then epic to legend. However, you guys do need to take note that you will still need to spend on your Vs in order for you to fuse the two horse so how much exactly for one fuse to tell the truth i actually do not have the answer yet we will need to wait for the bidding event which is gonna happen tomorrow so what do you guys think about this event do you guys think that this event is one of the event that you guys have been waiting for or this event is just a small part of the bigger update and of course if you love this kind of content do remember to like my video and subscribe to my channel until then i will see you guys again the next time